Hello everybody, I am Bramian19 and we're playing some more of our Ottoman Empire campaign in Supreme Ruler Ultimate. We have, uh, this is part two of that campaign and we're just kind of taking a look around. We have some of our early stuff being worked on. It looks like Panama and France are putting spies and stuff in my nation. That's really weird. I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, oh look, we're starting to align, uh, we're blue aligning. Which we can take a look at the alignments up, oh, wrong game menu. Let's do it right here. So you can see spear alignment. So we're starting to lean towards Norway, the UK, uh, United States, and people like that. Kind of NATO, which is what we really are anyway, um, in real life. We are just the first one on the list. And then if we go look down here, lots of non-aligned groups. And then here we go starting with India. We start hitting the red aligning, or red leaning and aligning. Quite a few guys in there. Is Bulgaria in that list? Yes, he is. That might be a good first target too. Get some uh, very crucial bits of uh, territory here. And that should put me, I'm guessing, yeah, Serbia is red aligning. So is the Serb Republic. So they have halved up uh, Bosnia and Serbia and all that still. Albania is still up there, which apparently we're great friends with Albania. That surprises me. Okay, Moldo uh, Moldova is red, Ukraine is red. Wow, this might be like a red versus blue fight going down. Let's see, we've got hydropower there. Let's see. Region falling, unit designs, construction's beginning. Wars declared, North Korea ceased to exist. All right, well, goodbye to you, that's fine. China has declared war on the Philippines. We're gonna condemn that move. Diplomatic offer from Thailand, they wanna give us rubber. They're requesting way too much. I don't care that much about rubber, are you kidding me? Let's look over here. Kind of a different situation going on over here. It won't be long, I don't think, before uh, South Korea. Let's see if I can get in there with them, there they are. Yeah, if they go to war with China, Japan likely comes in and helps too. Lots going on in that region. We need to stay away. Far away. We are kind of losing money. Take a look at that. We have another diplomatic offer from Iran. Uh, no. Reject. I'm sorry, Iran. We don't want your stuff. Our daily trades are what's killing us. What is our trades looking like? Hmm. I'm trying to see if I can find how much we... Everything's a little bit different, so I'm having to get used to between the two different systems here. I mean, you kind of see how much we... You know, if we were producing it, it would cost us 820. If we sold it, it would be 926. 70 and 77. 189, 210 in fuel. There he goes. China is declared war on South Korea. It's not good. Or not good for the normal people. We don't care. We're way over here. We'll just support who I feel like supporting. Why does Iraq have... Why does everybody have uh, spies in my territory? You guys suck. Give me... Where's my counter... Where's my counterintelligence team? Let's see if I can find that. I really do dislike how everything's turned around a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and turn the... Yeah, let's take a look at the theater really quick. Everything's kind of... gone to battle zones and theaters. What is this theater even? It's the Middle East, I guess? No, it's all Middle East. Let's see, battle zones. And then there's a theater overlay. Which I'm trying to get a look. Central Europe, Middle East. I guess that's the theater. Yeah, so. Let's go ahead. We're going to change some stuff up in here. Theater controls. Military priori priority gets to a medium. 
Balance diplomatically. Okay. Should be able to pump up some, some of our units to go up. There's no more uh, DEFCON settings. I really don't like that aspect. I like being able to change my DEFCON around. I mean, it's here, it's just not like I can change it. Okay, uh, I think we're fine here. South Korea is offering me rubber, 15 million, and are they requesting? Wait, what? L let me, hold on. Open the full message. They want to offer me 15 million for a, okay, yeah, no, sorry. We just don't play that game. We'll buy it on the open market. China and Papua New Guinea. Jesus, China. You are not afraid to make enemies, are you? It looks like they're doing really well against South Korea. Ugh. I'd hate to see China overrun the entire continent, but... I just don't see any other way for that to not happen. South Korea is smart. They'll just post a whole bunch of guys in these towns and wait it out. Or will they'll fight, they'll all fight to a stalemate in this region. Kind of surprised that Taiwan and them haven't gone out, gone to war yet. Okay, we'll focus on our own backyard again. I promise. This time, I promise. Whose nation is this? Oh, it's more Kurdistan. Which we're not really the best of friends with. We don't like the Kurds. They don't like us. The Islamic State's all the way down here now. Syria is not liking us. Bulgaria is in the middle. Greece is okay with us. Macedonia. So, okay. Let's see here. Looking at our expenses and stuff. We are spending... 886 million on let's see we're nowhere near what we should be spending in these places but there's nothing we could do about it quite yet we'll let that fluctuate for a little while until we can get our economy all fixed up okay um you sure you sir need to be locked Okay, no more, no more bonds for you. You shouldn't have done any more, I don't think. No, you did do a few more. Some small amounts. Uh, let's go ahead and repurchase those bonds. Get them off the system. There we go. I think we got them all fixed out now. The rest of them are all like 66, 67 billion dollars, so makes sense. Uh, Venezuela wants to offer. Uh, I don't like that deal. That's not good for us. Uh, unit designs are completing still. I think we've actually moved on to the barges. Okay, what's going on down here? War declared again on Cambodia by China. Yeah, China is not going to be liked by anybody when this is over with. If they're if they're not the last one standing. Okay, let's get ready here. How many military units have I had pop out? Hardly none. That's not good. I want to put like an aggressive like stance on now. Offensive. There we go. We'll put that up there. We'll see if maybe we can get a few more guys to pop out. Okay, a couple of stuff coming in. Rubber. That's not a good deal for us. Military goods. That is a good deal. Let's see. Uh, again, rubber. We're not good there either. Okay. That was like Norway and them trading rubber to us. I don't see that. Okay, um, that's left open, that's fine. Yeah, see the Suez, uh, Suez Canal is opened. Just lets anybody travel it. 
in the Panama Canal's actual zone as well. Which is pretty cool to me. I like seeing that kind of stuff. Alright, so that's not how you get your guys to pop out. Let's go ahead and get our military salaries up. Our training up. Lock minister from the... Ah, here we go. Units will retreat, increase work on you, will react in defensive. Okay, never mind. So that's just saying how much what these guys will all do. Increase the readiness, adjust unit deployments. So I could increase the readiness a little bit. Decrease the spending. Or go for a defensive military. See if they'll start deploying now. If I now that I click that, come on, let's see some see some units pop up. I don't see it. I just I'm not seeing it. It should do this on its own, right? Huh. Who is this? This is Libya. Libya is offering me 177 million for 214. I'm sorry, we just don't do deals when you guys don't want to pay me. Hmm. It's apparent I'm going to have to learn how to do some of this stuff. Custom priorities. Increasing readiness. Okay, so I can set custom priorities for my guys there. Missile loadouts, facility controls. Quite a bit here. Alright. Yeah, we have two. We can only do two at a time. I don't like that. We have an alert condition of high, though. Annual preparedness, efficiency bonus is up there. But nobody's deploying. No clue why that is. I never did get rid of all the bad guys that we don't like, did I? Let's get in there and do that. There we go. There's a, quite a few of them here. Yep, scrap. Scrap. We don't need any tow units. Okay, there's a Milan. Scrap it. Let's come down here to the artillery. There we go. Lots of uh, actually towed artillery in our. Okay. Trying to get rid of as many as I can. There we go. I'm starting to see the end of the rainbow here. They may shoot far, but they're not worth... They don't keep up with the army. and They're more for defense anyway. That's all we use artillery for. There's our Toad AA. And our other guys, too. Okay, come on. Okay, all the way down to the repair. We've got a hundred. Okay, our units are starting to deploy now, it looks like. Okay, um. It's not working. Um, okay, 
it's just weird. It's not letting me do like the normal stuff I can do. And I'm used to it letting me do all kinds of stuff. It's just a new game for me. It's been out a while, but I never did pick it up. Let's see. Should honestly let me just scrap it. Or even like reserve, but it won't. Okay, we'll just leave that there. Um, here's Istanbul. Can I change the capital now? Let's see. Hot spots. I have no clue. Okay, that's cool. That tells me what theater it's in. So I could kind of scroll over this bar and be just fine. Let's see, Istanbul. There it is, set the capital. So there it is now. We've moved the capital from Ankara to Istanbul. Got 77 units scrapped. Uh, and we don't want any of those units that you're trying to give us. Military goods, that's a good deal. Unit design complete. To properly support their sustained military efforts, the Defense Department has requested that I stockpile military significant. Agree. Okay, war declared. Tajikistan. Condemn. War declared. Indonesia. Condemn. We're starting to really not like them. And we've actually, I think we've become very blue. Uh, we are definitely more of a blue aligned than anything right now. Look at all these guys who are out here ready to... So I just can't collect them though and then tell them, hey, this is what you're supposed to do. There's a filter unit selection. That's a pretty neat little feature if it lets you do it. I think you can. Ooh, there we go. Let's reserve everybody for just a second. Let's see if they'll all pop back out on their own. I have a feeling I hit a button that let them do what they did. Scrap him. There we go. Got him scrapped up. Where are you at? Okay. See, this guy is... Okay. It says right here. Okay, that's what I wanted. Right here. Scrap. Okay. Perfect. Now it looks like these units, let's see if they pop back out on their own. If I've got to go through there and determining which units need to be uh, popped out or not. Industrial goods, that's not a good deal. Okay, war declared. Russia's declared war on Estonia. If I was the US, I'd be like supporting everybody right now, trying to get everybody's military ready to fight them. But I'm not. I'm just the. I'm just Turkey. If you look, we've got yeah, 15, 16. So we are starting to pump units into the order. Sweden offering 330. Yeah, we're going to accept that one. It costs us money, but we can turn around and sell it as well. I want these guys to all be ready. We're going to go this direction. We're going to take Bulgaria. And then probably have to take Romania. I'm taking everybody in red through here. You know, despite us all being apparent friends and everybody liking each other, I really want the, this land for ourselves. Just like I want the Middle East. Syria is like in the middle. Shouldn't they be red aligned? That's odd to see. Shouldn't Iran be red aligned? Huh. Who are they at war with? I would I would assume they would have been at war by now. They're not. Huh. Rouhani has not sent them to war yet. 365. No, I'm sorry. Netherlands. Let's look at our military right now. We only have 16 that are out. Is that because we put a hot spot in a place too? 
No. Just made me think that we had a hot spot ready. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna just have to wait for our units to come out. Okay, thank you for telling me about that capital move that I already know. Our production, let's take one look at it really quick. Timber, of course, is doing fine. I think all that's done. It is. Oil is doing fine. Just by a little bit, though. Power should be get, having to be worked on right now. Let's see. Consumer. Goods places we're good on. Industrial, it should be finishing up. Military, it should be good on. Okay. Let's get rid of these. Uh, that's a bad deal. That's a good deal. Some region just fell. Estonia, they cease to exist. China declares on Taiwan. And that's a bad deal. Okay. Alright guys, well I appreciate y'all so much for watching. I know there's been nothing happening but China just declaring war on everybody. And Russia starting to as well. I think we're getting ready to uh, move in to some war preparations here. And... Uh, go after Bulgaria. I think if we take them out, then we should start getting our uh, European focus going. So, alright guys, appreciate y'all so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time.